Breaking news, the desperate search to find a middle school student in Lake Fairview continues this afternoon, 18 hours after crews started looking for him. Police say that boy was one of five kids on a boat that capsized after lightning struck just before 6 o'clock last night. Tony Atkins has been at the lake all morning and joins us live with new information. Tony. It's been a long morning, Sheldon, for deputies and police out here desperately trying to find this missing student. I counted four boats out here this morning just before the noon hour, the most we've seen all day. I also want to show you a view from Chopper 2 as they continue that search here over the lake. The initial call came in just before 6 p.m. yesterday evening. Deputies say a nonprofit rowing club, the North Orlando Rowing Club, was practicing here on the waters of Lake Fairview when and lightning struck causing the boat to capsize. We've learned the five person team is a middle school age group. One of the students was taken to Avent Health and three more were able to go home with their families. Right now here still at this noon hour, the fifth one is the one that crews are still trying to find. The principal for Annunciation Catholic Academy sent a letter to parents late last night saying the missing student attends that school. We were told the school's parish did make it here on the scene and there there will be extra counselors at the school's building today as this situation unfolds. Here near the lake, we had a chance to speak with residents who really gave us an idea of how strong yesterday's storms were. But I was on my porch watching it rain and a big old pop of lightning come and I seen it and it made me run back in the house. It's very sad. I don't like to see anybody hurt or anybody lost, especially children. And as you can see, this is still a very active situation right now. We're still working to learn more about this missing student as well as the condition of the other student who remains in the hospital for now.